Hey guys, I'm Chinonso, and today we will be talking about average speed. Now, what is average speed? Well, it's, pre- it's pretty much self-explanatory. It's just, well, the average speed. It's very intuitive. The formula for average speed is the total distance divided by the total time. So, like I said... Average speed, just the average speed of any object, and this is the total distance of, of the total time. It's really easy. Don't overthink it. Let's get in, into our first practice problem. Jonas is going to his friend's house. He walks 100 meters, and then stops to, to take a break. He then walks another 40 meters and arrives at his friend's house. He does all of this in 1 minute and 10 seconds. What is Jonas's average speed in meters per second? So let's try to find his average speed. Well, to find Jonas's average speed, we just use our equation. Average speed equals total distance divided by the total time taken. Now, what is Jonas's Total distance. Well, it's pretty. Well, it's pretty easy. It's pretty easy to find. His total distance will be one hundred meters plus forty meters. So it's going to be one hundred meters plus forty meters, and the total time is one minute and ten seconds. Now, what is one hundred meters plus forty meters? Well, 100 meters plus 40 meters is obviously 140 meters. And then divide that by 1 minute and 10 seconds. So, are, are we done? No. You want to find his average speed in meters per second. Let me, let me highlight that. Meters per second. So, 1 minute and 10 seconds isn't... All in seconds. So we want to find his average speed in meters per second. So we have to, to convert 1 minute, minute and 10 seconds to just seconds. In 1 minute and 10 seconds, just equals 70 seconds. Since 60 plus 10 is 70. So his average speed is going to be 140 meters divided by 70 seconds. And 140 divided by 70 is obviously 2. So his average speed is 2 meters per second. There, we're done. It's pretty easy. Uh, average speed is one of the most easiest things in physics. Now, let's actually, tr- let's actually try to graph Jonas's average speed. So let's, so let's just try to graph his average speed real quick. Okay, so if his average speed is 2 meters per second, then to graph it on, on, so to graph it, we must make the slope equal to 2 meters per second. So if we graphed his, so if we graphed his speed, it's going to look something like this. This is, this is, so this line represents Jones's average speed. Since at 20 meters, this is meters, this is seconds. Since at 20 meters, he's, 10 seconds has passed. And 20 over 10 is 2. So yeah, that's how you graph average speed. To graph average speed, you just make the slope equal to the average speed. So yeah, that is what average speed is. I'll see you guys on next video.